race. And we're encouraging anybody who's actually going to participate in the race or knows anything about the race to give towards this wonderful cause. My name is Ronald Fiennes. I lead expeditions all over the world, but today I'm at the London Eye because we have an initiative to help visually impaired people all over the world. Seeing is believing is the initiative. And we have 285 million people who are visually impaired and could have that impairment prevented. And that's what it's all about. Through the Standard Charter Great City Race, our aim is to improve the sight of 6,500 children. Seeing is Believing is a collaboration between the Standard Chartered Bank and the International Agency for the Prevention of Blindness. Seeing is Believing is able to do an awful lot with not very much money. We are aiming to raise 20 million pounds and bearing in mind that only 20 pounds can actually give a cataract operation to make someone see and nine pounds can buy a pair of spectacles to make a child be able to read. That's a fantastic amount of return for not too much money. In the United Kingdom, we have a lot of ways with the NHS of preventing blindness. But all over the world, in less developed countries, you've got a huge problem because if somebody goes blind, it can affect the community, it can certainly affect the family. If the breadwinner goes blind, then the family faces starvation. If a child goes blind, that child's education is ruined forever. When I do an expedition, whether it's in a hot country or a cold country, we use the best possible equipment and everything is like it should be at the start. We have our visual ability and that's without it you couldn't do an expedition. But what we're talking about is people all over the world who are visually impaired unnecessarily, but those countries don't have the right equipment to put it right. And that is where seeing as believing can help in a huge way. Thank you.